icon for uh, for any type of software, I guess, or script. Uh, now I'm just going to use my uh, OP25 uh, script here that I have right here. Now if we just run this, I'll show you what it does. It automatically opens up a browser and starts the uh, program for phase two. <clears throat> so it opens it up, give it a second here, it'll probably refresh. And there we go. So that's basically what it does. But we don't want to do all that, so we can just create a desktop icon, like a shortcut like I got here. So the first thing we'll want to do is go up here to the menu, Preferences, <clears throat> then click on Main Menu Editor, and once this is up, we're going to click on New Item. <clears throat> then we can name this whatever. We can just say OP25 GUI. Let me rename this something else here. We'll just call it GUI. OP25. You can name it whatever you feel like. So now we're going to go ahead and throw our uh, command in here. So we're just going to click on uh, browse. We're going to click on this guy because that's where it's at. So wherever you might have your script at, you can locate it. Now we can launch it in the terminal, but we don't want a terminal showing in the background. So we're just going to let that go like that. So as you can see, it put it right here. So we're just going to click OK. <clears throat> so if we click on this icon again, as you can see, here it is. So we're going to go to right click, go to properties. Then we're going to click right here because we want to add a uh, image. So we're going to click on image files. Then we can go to desktop. I just picked a, an image off the internet for this. Then we're going to click OK. So if we go back under other. Oh, there it is. We're going to right click again, add the desktop. And now, if we click, <clears throat> I have it on a delay, a sleep for like eight seconds, so that's why it takes a few seconds for it to load up. And there we go. And as you can see, the script's working, and uh, that's pretty much about it. Now, if you do need to uh, have it set up to do the uh, terminal, you can right click on it, properties. Click on desktop entry and you can choose here if you want. So hopefully this kind of helps you out. Uh, stay tuned for another one and don't forget to hit the like, share, and subscribe.